Alright, we are ready to go for round two. Earlier today, did the Fish USA Bait Challenge. Round two, different part of the lake. We're gonna go fishing deeper now. Earlier today, we were fishing pretty shallow. Now we're gonna go offshore, fish a little deeper because they were not having it shallow. I fished about seven hours this morning with like not many fish. Had lunch and I'm like ready to go fishing again. Like, I'm pumped, I'm excited. I'm kind of obsessed with fishing if you haven't noticed. But uh, let's get out on the water and hopefully it's better afternoon evening bite than it was this morning. Junk fishing. Alrighty, thanks. Tried a bunch of stuff. Man, look how short and stout that fish is. Alright, maybe a sign. White chatterbait. Man, I can't remember the last time I threw a white chatterbait. Nice one. Oh, yeah. oh my god, there's a big one with it. There's another good one with it. Yes, that is what we came for. Redemption. I think there's a bunch of fish under it. Oh no, 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 no. Don't do that. That's a nice Clear Lake bass right there. I've been waiting so long to catch one like that here. Nice fat fish. White chatterbait. Maybe we're onto something here. Thank you, sir. Right here, it's got him apparently. Three bites in the same area. Oh, there's a fish right there. This one little spot's loaded. I think I figured out a bait that they want, finally, other than a drop shot. White chatter bait, slow rolling it. that it's a nice little surprise all right a frog fish sweet and he gave us a dance Whew. back at the hotel the nunez hotel what's up man what's happening dude how'd your uh... how was it Ooh, it was rough is brutal. Still caught a few good ones. That's the nice thing about Clear Lake. Even though it's tough, you can catch some good ones. Man, they're tough to find sometimes. I've talked to some other guys today too, and they tough? said it was really, really tough. Oh yeah, I believe it. Something yeah. funky has been going on this week. I think it has something to do with the moon. I think so too, for sure. Or I'll just say that to make me feel better. But <laughs> it's, I think it's beer time. Actually, by yeah. I was filling Juan in about the Fish USA August challenge, and I was just telling him about the baits. And you guys saw that video. I think it was I don't know six days ago. I uploaded it, but. Uh, 
The one bait that I was not too impressed with was the Savage Gear Cicada, which uh, Juan is curious about. So we're gonna, I mean, the lake is like, Two just, blocks. Just two blocks away. So he wants to go test it out. If, he ca if you catch one on that, I'll be so pissed. <laughs> his truck up. He blew his truck up? Yeah. Another truck. Oh, we're catching it. Crop again. Really? Yeah. I think I really want to throw that thing out. Frog it. Frog it. Are you throwing? Oh, I thought, dude, I thought you were throwing a frog on a... Um, <laughs> on a spinning rod? Spinning <laughs> rod. I was like... Oh, man. Really? I'm changing my tactics. <laughs> Living dangerously. <laughs> The best trick I've learned recently, shoving a little uh, split shot weight in the frog to weigh it down, make it rattle, it helps so much with those thick, thick mats. Uh -huh. Wanna try a different spot? Yeah, might as well. Stop number two. Nothing crazy. Super pressured by live worms and live bait. <laughs> oh, that's good. So. So my plastic worm should do great. Might as well dig up an earthworm and put it on there. <laughs> Watch Juan catch one on the the bug. Dude, that thing actually works pretty good. It's not the coolest looking. <laughs> Just like it's hung up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, there's bait everywhere though. Like this leg is just loaded with bait. We're going to a top secret place? Yeah. Oh god. You sure you want to do this? Yeah. It's really small. Super secret Ooh. spot, guys. Super secret spot. Trail beers. Looks like it's kind of open. Oh. Juan, are you taking me somewhere to murder me? Okay, so this right here. Yeah. That little rant, that is poison oak. What about this? This right here, that's poison oak, and this right here is poison oak, but I can push this down. Hold on, don't touch that either. Man, sketchy. Right, okay. Don't let him do I'm not there. <laughs> if we get any uh, fish, we're gonna have to flip them. <laughs> Bank flip them. Oh, hey, Juan. <laughs> Dude, making me look bad. You're like third cast with oh. the. What was that? Oh, he choked up a. Or he... Senko. Yeah, he choked up a Senko. The chartreuse, very chartreuse. Senko. Very chartreuse Senko. All right, guys, you saw me fail epically with that in the Fish USA challenge. Juan just proved that it catches six inches. <laughs> there we go. I got your follow up fish. Feels like a six incher. Oh yeah, it's all uh, six inches, man. Better than no inches. That's true. <laughs> There's a lot of those in this lake. Well, no skunk. That's good. Caught one on the cricket. I caught one on the worm. Better one. Not huge, but better. No. Water skiing. Eight incher. Ten inches next. Out here. It's actually kind of like a maze back here. Yeah, it is. I'd be something in the road, but that's for sure. It's, it's long and slender. Yeah. Yeah, I'm always like watching my step now at Barry, Barry S in the morning. There's a snake. I think it's, nope, it's a snake. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's a little snake. What kind of snake is it? Oh, no. I'm not positive. Oh, Hopefully, good. it's not one that wants to bite at all. Well, well, thank you for the, the uh, adventure. <laughs> That'll uh, beef up the content right there. All right, guys. Good morning. 6 a.m. All loaded up. Last day here at Clear Lake. Yesterday pretty much was a grind. Just not the Clear Lake fishing that I was hoping for. So today's another day. We've got till about noon. Six hours to fish. Hopefully they're biting today. Let's just uh, go out there, see what we can figure out. Let's see what happens.
What? So it's getting crushed right there. There we go. That was that fish right there. Coming right at me. It's a big one. Oh my god, they're going crazy right here. It's a nice one. Oh, let's get back in there. So strong. And a chunk. One of my favorite summertime colors for the Z drop is the uh, green weenie. Let's see if he wants a swim jig. Oh! Wow, he came right out and got it. That was so sweet. That was awesome. <laughs> That was a hungry fish, man. Another nice one. That was so awesome. <laughs> Followed up with a swim jig. That is cool. Oh, there's a fish. These clear lake fish just fight so hard. They're so strong. You can tell by the way they look, too. Just brutes. Another good one. See what I mean? Just all thick, solid fish. There we go. Looks like there's a pile of them right here. Found a little concentration. Oh, gosh. So fun. Man. Oh, that's a jumper. How fun is this? Ah, yes, that is fun. They're on. Oh man, they are there. They're all they're all solid ones too. Okay, let's just get back in there. Sweet. There we go. <laughs> They're just all under that dock right there. Just waiting for this current to go by them. With bait and 
What else? <laughs> cool. <laughs> there we go. Oh no! It should come off. Oh, there's a bite. I want to get a big one. This one might be... I can't tell. I literally can't tell. They all fight so hard. You just can't really tell. This one does feel big, though. Could be a five. Could be a three. See? It's not even that big of a fish. There's this dog in there. It's pretty good, actually. Thick though, look at how healthy that fish is. Look how just thick. Clear lake, no place like it. Here we go, finally. Just let it sit there. These are all like clone three pounders. Like clones of each other. Two and a half, three pounds. That's cool. Alrighty, guys, it is 11 o'clock. Yesterday, the past couple videos, as you probably have seen, were really tough. But today, the bite picked up, the wind picked up, these fish were setting up. Gonna head home a little early. Back to work for me. Always nice to get away and come to a lake like Kuna Lake. We actually have a tournament coming up here in a few weeks, so that's gonna be a fun one. This is an amazing fishery. So that's always a tournament each year that I look forward to. Today, chatterbait, white moving baits were seemingly getting bit for me in the past day or two. And then dead stick and a drop shot was honestly the best way to catch these fish. That green weenie, Zoom Z Drop, is one of my favorite colors for summer bass. Everything, as always, will be linked in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for coming along. We'll see you later.